Hey guys, today's video is another trend drop with Rimmel London. This time I'm going to show you how to achieve these two grey lip looks. As you can see, one is a more wearable everyday look and the other is an edgy party look. So if you guys want to see how to get these, then just keep watching. So this is our first more wearable look. I've already done my base and primed my eyes, so now I'm going in with the Rimmel Magnifies Nude Edition palette. I'm gonna grab this brown shade on a fluffy blending brush and buff this into my crease as our transition shade. Then just on the same brush, I'm gonna take this silver shade and blend it into my crease and out of V, just to add a little more depth. And still with that silver shade, I'm gonna take some on a pencil brush and use it to smoke out my lower lash line. Next up, I'm going in with this deep gray shade and blending this into my outer V. I love these palettes because as you guys can see, all these shades are super easy to blend. Now I'm gonna grab this white shade on a flat shader brush and I'm gonna use it to highlight the inner corners of my eyes just to brighten my eyes up a little. I feel like things were looking a little bit dark. Then I'm gonna blend this gold shade onto my eyelid just with my finger. Obviously you can use a brush if you want to. I was just out of clean flat shader brushes and my finger works just as well. And now I'm going in with the uh, gray side of the Rimmel Magnifies Double Ended Shadow and Liner just to deepen up my lash line. These are awesome because they're waterproof and seriously last all day. Then I'm just gonna go in with some of the Rimmel Wonderfully Real Mascara with Keratin and some natural looking false lashes. Onto our face, I'm gonna start off with the uh, contour shade in this Rimmel Kate Sculpt palette and use it to bronze up the outside of my face. Then I'm just gonna go in with the blush shade from the palette as well and I'm just applying that to the apples of my cheeks. For my highlight, I'm gonna use the Rimmel Magnifies Holographic Eyeshadow and Face Highlighter in the shade Gilded Moon. These holographic eyeshadows are actually really cool, especially when they catch the light and they just make your cheekbones pop. And for our lips, this is the star of the show. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Shadow. These are really long wearing and have a velvet matte finish, so I really like them. And this is our finished first look. Now for look number two, I'm going to start off with this brown shade from the Rimmel Magnifies Color Edition palette and blend it into my crease as our transition shade. Then I'm going to take this Rimmel Scandalized Brow and Liner Kajal Pencil in Cobalt Crazy and blend this in all over my lid. These set really quickly and do not move once they've set, so if you're using it as an eyeshadow base like me, make sure you work really quickly. Next, I'm going in with this bright blue shade from the palette and first I'm going to pack it all over my lid with a flat shader brush. Then I'm going to switch to a blending brush and blend this shade up into my crease as well uh, just to make sure there are no harsh lines. I'm going to grab this dark blue and use it to darken up my crease and the outer corner of my lids to add some more definition. And I'm just using the same blending brush for this. Next up, I'm going in with this white shimmer shade and using it to highlight my brow bone and the inner corners of my eyes. So I've been loving the combination of blue and pink together lately. You may have noticed on my Instagram. So I'm gonna take the Rimmel Fierce Fuchsia Scandalized Brow and Liner Kajal and smudge this into my lower lash line. I'm also gonna drag the smudge out past the corner of my eye just to elongate my eyes a little. And to finish my eyes, I'm just gonna go in with some mascara and lashes. Now onto blush, I'm using this middle shade from the Rimmel Kate blush palette and applying it to the apples of my cheeks. And then for highlighter, I'm going to use another one of those Magnifies Holographic Eyeshadow and Highlighters. Uh, this one's in the shade Luna Lilac. The shade is so pretty. 
I also wanted to add a little bit of sparkle to my highlight. So I'm just going to take some of the Rimmel Lip Art in the shade Blush Gold and tap this on over the highlight. And then to finish off this look, I'm going in with that Rimmel Stay Matte Liquid Lip Color in Shadow again. So these are the finished looks. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys haven't yet. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys!